Welcome to Final Fantasy VII with me, Matthew Caddis, Freaky and Poogie. So I'm going to put Barrett in my party before we face Ojo, because there is a weapon that we can only get with him here. Yes, so, um, even though I did equip it with the micro laser, um, I will be keeping it for a while, I say, because, well, um, we'll see in a moment. But for now, let's equip some stuff. So, Phoenix, I guess, will do this kill me. There are some strong enemies up here, which I actually run away from because they were very, very strong. Seriously, I did try to fight them, but as I say, I do not want to waste my um, MP and everything on them because I'm a bigger fish to fry than just them. But I will leave them in anyway because, well, um, it is good to see them anyway, so yeah. So, with that said, let's. Um, MP Turbo, I'll have to give it to a decent one. Shiva, I'm not gonna use much. Seriously. Um, unlike with Final Fantasy um, VIII, um, it probably won't work that well. And I should have really. Oh, I'm finally clipping the manipulate. Unless I'm trying to get some more um, things there. There are also two treasure chests there, which apparently I missed, but never mind. This is the first of the new enemies, the Nose Panzer, big, seriously, so, gigantic tank, very large. Unfortunately, its attacks can do over 2,000 HP damage, and that's not good. Um, I have not got life 2 yet, so that's a pain in the ass. So, yeah, uh, maybe I should have gone for, um, well, maybe not White Wind, but certainly, um, Q... Q3, because that would have done it. Uh, seriously, and Big Guard. And that's not the only enemy that kills me here. Oh no. Um, but, um, that being said, let's see what's in here. So, firstly, we have an elixir. Too bad. And a mystical. I, um, that's actually a decent piece of armor. The other enemy. And apparently, I'm facing another gross panther. Yeah, seriously. Um, certainly being in a job about the Shinra being in the big group. So I'm going to leave this in because I did actually use Big Guard here. So let's see how I do here against this uh, gigantic tank. And the usual uh, Final Fantasy shit of um, actually reviving a, a character of when they were, I guess, low HP. But yeah, I want to see what happens if the... Um, actually attack a person. Okay, never mind. I didn't bother. I'm just wasting my um, X portions here. The thing I, I found most of them when I was um, uh, back on Utah, so yeah. In case it is up here and, it, and if it isn't obvious, we have to follow him. So, indeed, let's do so. And if you see him, again, you can turn on, uh, press the giant button, I don't know what it's called there. Uh, Vincent is here, and apparently he's uh, only the woman who took his love. Over here is where we want to get our thing here. And we're going to run, run into more members of Soldier. These are actually first class soldiers. And they do a, quite a bit of damage as well, so... Yeah, they're as bad as the Gross Panthers, seriously. Now, I don't want to waste my items or MP on these guys, seriously. Um, I suppose I could go with the um, organics, but yeah. And stop jumping on my. What are you doing? Did he just jump on Barra? That look. That just looks. That just looks wrong in my opinion. Seriously. Murder blitz, whatever. I don't like this. Whatever. I'm in speed now. And um um um. There I see, um, Q3 isn't, uh, not Q3, um, Whitewind isn't doing its job, I don't know why, but yeah, anyway, this is what we're going for, the missing score, Barrett's ultimate weapon, if you don't have Barrett in your party, then you will not be able to get this gun, so yeah, that is the main reason I have him in my party, so yes, like with all ultimate weapons, 
it is pretty much zero growth. So you may want to look at level up all your materia uh, if you wish. Um, I'm not that kind of guy. You know how I am with my games. So I'm going to go straight to Hojo. Um, I may want to use a couple of turbo even if I have them. Why am I scrolling down so quickly? Seriously. Well, I have five turbo ethers, so I think I should be okay, but I think I may rearrange my items so I don't have the same problem I had with the proud claw. So I will see you in a moment when I reach Hojo. Okay, then we're back. So, um, here is Hojo frantically um, plonking away on the controls of the uh, thing. I don't think he will. Uh, Um, oh, I thought you'd forgotten your name. Ah! Oh. I guess. Oops, um. Oh, really? You're going to hit yourself? I don't think he will. He's gone off the deep end there, Cloud, if you know what I mean. Send him some energy to take down the barrier. Yeah, why do that indeed? Um, don't answer with an insult there, um, Gojo. Uh, no, 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 don't come equate us to, well, not Bardock. Um, yeah, I think it's too late now. Wait, your son? Sephiroth is your son. I don't see the resemblance. Did sort of create several. But, um, and... Okay, he's really gone insane. Um, we. Um, I think he's not. Oh dear, I think I know who that is. Wait, you gave him. How does that even work when Lucretia had Sephiroth? You gave her the Genova cells. How do you give it to a baby who's still in the womb? Does that mean you give the Genova cells to the mother? Holy crap, this guy is insane. Um, excuse me. Oh dear. He's injected Genova cells into his own body! Oh, yeah, looks like we're fighting Hojo! And yes, this is a very tough boss fight, because Hojo has three forms. Firstly, um, he will um, send out his specimens. Yes, oh, and also, um, um so, yeah, so... Once he sends out his, um, capsule, this sends out his thing. Now, you do not want to attack the, uh, specimens that are with him, because, um, it will just not hit Hojo. You want to focus on Hojo, therefore, because of that. I'm going to start with, um, a bit of, um, um, thing. and you... Uh, for Big Guard and Region, and then use uh, of all of my Bahamas. Uh, maybe I should have gone with Bing, but never mind. Bahamas Zero! So, yeah, I do not want to waste any more time. I'm going to use that. So, yeah, um, his. Um, uh, what I say? His, uh, experiments and whatnot will attack you um, for a small amount of damage at least. So, yeah. Um, as I say, so long as you keep damaging Hojo, um, summons will still work. Just don't attack the beast. So, yes. And am I glad I'm playing the uh, HD version with the sped up footage, seriously. I know I've said this quite a lot in my Let's Play, but yeah. It really helps with the thing. 
After all, um, the ability to skip summons was not a thing until Final Fantasy IX. What the hell is the macro juice? Well, um, here in comes his second form. We've done enough damage to Hojo. Now he becomes Helictic Hojo, and what he will do is inflict a vi well various status ailments on you. He does cast Confuse on the uh, Teva there, and um, yeah, the match is weird with it. He shows a gigantic Chocobo. Yeah, the fat Chocobo, in fact, which is a thing that you can summon with a Chocobo mod. Now, um, regen's gone, so I would probably want to do this. Again, it does also help if you have, um, the ribbon <laughs> equipped to one of your party. Um, but especially that one who has, um, either Asuna or Whitewind, because that will get rid of status ill. So, yeah. The, um, Helictic Bojo also has various different um, body parts you have to attack. So yeah, uh, although um, it isn't vital that you KO all of, um, all of them at once, so yeah. Um, so that's basically the fact. I also like the fact that the Genova theme is played here. Probably for... Actually, no, it's not the last time we'll hear it. We will hear it, I think, uh, towards the end of the game, so yeah. Anyway, the thing I wanted to do off screen was actually um, move my healing items I really needed up front, such as the Turbo Ethers and, I guess, Elixirs. Seriously. Uh, and now he's casting Sleep on the Barret. Seriously. Uh, poison's enough. Seriously, but there you go. But yeah, with them. Um, even with, especially with the thing is, level 1 limit break, with the um, missing score equipped, Barrett is doing over 3,000 damage, it's insane, man. That is his weakest thing, I haven't really put that much effort into leveling up uh, Barrett's limit break, but he's really doing some damage to Hojo, let me tell you. Uh, and I don't know how, um, well actually I do in the case of the thing, the um, poison... It just takes a small amount of damage, it doesn't slowly drain like in Final Fantasy 13, for example. And yes, I am spamming quite a bit of Ultima on um, Gojo there. So yeah, and uh, I'm fun. Uh, again with the sleep spell! Seriously. Thankfully it isn't working. I'm going to use Poisoner on the uh, Barret, and then, um, let's see. Yeah, I'll use, um, maybe Ultima? I suppose I could use, um, Comet 2. The problem with Comet 2 is its effects are random, so it will hit, um, multiple targets randomly, if you know what I mean. It's good against one person, but against one opponent, sorry, if, if it's, um, if you use it against more than one, then, yeah, it can be a bit of trouble. Now, um, Hojo is now um, degenerating into his third form, Life Form Hojo! Oh yes, and Life Form Hojo is even quicker, because he can actually uh, combo you to death while inflicting various status ailments on your party. Seriously, it is very annoying when he uses that. He can also use Silence, which is not great either. Um, and that combo move, yeah. Um, if you have the thing equipped, then of course he'll just do uh, random damage. Not too much. And especially if you have big guard up, and I just cast it, um, then uh, Hojo will um, only um, do less damage. Basically. So, yeah. You can also cast stop. And unlike with um, some of the other status ailments that um, Hojo has used, Stop, stop, sorry, cannot be stopped. I don't believe I'm saying that, but stop cannot be stopped unless, um, um, where I say, um, I can't be stopped by using uh, Esuna or White Wind, so yeah. One of those few ones that can't, so yeah. While you're living, of course, so yeah. I think Zombie is the, well, Zombie is the thing, I think, in this game. It is in uh, the next Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy VIII, but there you go. 
slow. Um, that can be remedied with, by using haste if you still have the time material. So yeah, uh, that is a problem for the sake. And what's um, he turned into a frog there? Let's see what bad breath does. Uh, nothing. I expected on, on the boss. So let's summon uh, Bahamut. Yes, he's still useful here, as is, I guess, Odin. Yeah, Odin is still useful in these fights, so yeah. Um, indeed, there we go. Yeah, 3,000 damage, not bad at all. And what else does 3,000 damage? Probably big shot. And yeah, that's basically the thing. Um, And yeah, Comet 2 will be useful here. Yeah, there we go. Yeah, much better against one opponent in this case. So yeah, I'm my ass clobbered here. Uh, I don't care, I'm going to use Wiping. That I do not want to uh, physically attack my party either. So, why don't you go for it there, Tifa? Seriously, if that's not enough to kill him, uh, that might not be enough to kill him, to be fair. I don't know. And, um, there we go! Nope, so, I guess we'll have to move on with that. Speed up the thing, I might use, want to use the fight wing, yes. Then, is that enough to kill Hojo? No, not yet. Yeah, uh, I this, I absolutely hate this. White Wind, yes, definitely. Indeed, then we'll use a big shot. I don't want to use Ultimate. It's good against multiple opponents, not so much against one. Anyway, Hojo's finally down, and that puts an end to the Shinra's ambitions, we think. So, on the next episode, well, figure out what to do next after we have beaten Hojo. So, until then. Well, I guess I will see you later. Yeah, well, that being said, um, the cannon is done. Anyway, I will see you later. Goodbye!